I'm Dr. Saranya. I'm a pediatric dentist practicing in Bangalore. I have done my graduation from Chennai and my post graduation that is MDS from Oxford Dental College, Bangalore. I have my own practice, Krishna Dental Studio in Kormangla, Bangalore. And I'm also associated with multiple clinics and hospital as a consultant pediatric dentist. Ideally, any non-nutritive sucking habits that the child has has to stop by the time the teeth start coming into the mouth or latest by three years of age. This is given recommendation by American Academy of Pediatric Dentistry. Now, if the habits do not stop early on, there is a chance that the teeth alignment or the teeth position especially the upper front teeth position can change and if it prolongs after three years of age the development of the upper jaw or the lower jaw can also change in addition to this even if the child is using a pacifier or has to use a pacifier it is very important to take notes that the shape of the pacifier that is being used is as close to the physiological nipple that the child is used to while breastfeeding the second thing to take care of is that making sure the pacifier is not sweetened or dipped in honey or coated with any layer of sugar before putting it in the child's mouth. This can increase the risk of decay as the sweet remains in contact with the teeth for a very long period of time. Another thing to notice and take care of is every time the pacifier comes out and goes into the mouth, it is very important to clean, sterilize or sanitize the pacifier before putting it in the mouth. Otherwise, a lot of outside germs can go into the mouth which which can lead to further health problems in the child. Now, if the pacifier use is not stopped by three years of age, when we start noticing that the upper front teeth start coming forward, the lip position changes and after three years, breaking the habit also becomes very difficult. Before three years, you can just break the habit with home remedies, but after three, we'll have to intervene clinically, probably give appliances that we fix into the mouth so that the sucking habits come down and the treatment cannot be just home-based and it becomes much more difficult for weaning the child of such habits.